Hi there, this is Lynn Allen. Welcome to another AutoCAD tip courtesy of Catalyst Magazine. Thank you for joining me. Today I'm going to share with you a tip that's going to help you save your current AutoCAD settings and environment and user interface to the cloud. Why would you want to do that? Well, I bet you that you like to work in AutoCAD and have it set up a completely different way than I like to have it set up. And have you ever, heaven forbid, had to work on somebody else's AutoCAD station and dealt with the way they liked it set up? <laughs> well, you can save all of your cozy, comfortable settings to the cloud, to your Autodesk 360 account, and then you can download them anywhere. So if you went to your coworker station, you could download your settings. Oh, they will love that. <laughs> or if things go terribly wrong in your AutoCAD, you can download those settings and put things back to normal uh, in no time at all. Or if you go home and you wanna set up your home computer the same way you have it in the office. So let me show you how it's done. So first off, you need to go to the Autodesk 360 tab. And I should say, you need to have an Autodesk 360 account, which is free and it's easy. And uh, right off the bat, it gives you, gives you five gigabytes of storage. There's a lot of advantages to having an Autodesk 360 account, but I'm gonna show you how to use it for syncing your settings, okay? So you're gonna go to Online Options, and here you'll see an option that says, Sync my settings with the cloud. I want to do that. Choose which settings are synced. Well, let's take a look at those settings. All right, options, that's pretty obvious, right? Anything that you have set inside of options and your profiles, your customization files, okay, those are your, M your menu files, your CUI files, uh, custom icons, uh, workspaces as well. Printer support files, I think that's pretty straightforward. Custom hatch patterns, your tool palettes that you work so hard on, and of course, some drawing template files. You can easily have all of that set to the cloud. You can also have any custom fonts, shapes, and line types, you know, so make sure that you have them saved and set aside as well. I'm not gonna select those because I have to restart AutoCAD to show those to you, and it's not gonna go like that. <laughs> so I'm gonna set as many of them I can without having to restart AutoCAD, and I'm gonna say okay. Another okay to get out. And I'm going to say use my local settings. I want you to take a look at my environment right now and I want you to save that to the cloud. Okay, and if you take a look at the screen, you'll see it says it's uploading my settings to my Autodesk 360 account. All right, so now I'm going to turn sync my settings off. Stop syncing my settings. All right, let's make some changes. Let's go into the options dialog box. Let's do something crazy like change our background color. Let's change it to a color I jokingly say most of us wouldn't know if it were not for AutoCAD. That would be cyan. <laughs> it's not like you have cyan in your everyday conversation. Apply and close, say okay. All right, so that's pretty obvious, right? That's a pretty obvious change. And let's also change our workspace. So I'm in drafting and annotation. I'm gonna change it to 3D modeling. All right, completely different, all right? So, definitely different. <laughs> so, now I want to, you can see my, my command line moved. I don't have my layer manager on the left-hand side. Um, a lot of things have changed. Okay, so now I'm going to go back up to Autodesk 360, and I'm gonna say, say sync my settings, start syncing my settings now, and I'm gonna tell it, oh, go get the ones online. Go get the, the nice ones I left up on the cloud. And you'll see it takes a second. But it puts everything back to the way it was before and now I'm so happy, right? My workspace is back to the way it was. You'll see that my background color is back to white and the land of Lynn is back to happiness again. <laughs> so that was easy enough, right? I used to teach AutoCAD and I, I taught in a lab and all the students would mess up all the computers. I just think how great this would be for teachers to have all the students have their, you know, sync their settings to the cloud so that when they come into the classroom, they can download their AutoCAD set up the way they like to work. So definitely try this out. It's a great, easy tool to have to save everything just in case of a rainy day in case you need it. And promise me that you will join me back here in two more weeks. All right, thanks for joining me.